Welcome to Selenium Master video tutorial. In this video tutorial, I will explain how to add a test automation script to an existing automation framework. Let's open an existing test case. From the start menu, let's right click on the command prompt, run as administrator click yes so let's open the write IDE write.py so this is the existing login test case and it has login suite and valid user login so if we look at the structure of the test we imported the selenium to libraries and we defined uh, four variables for web elements and we have a test case valid user login in robot framework test cases are executed in the order which they are created. So let's add another test case logout. On the login suite, right click and select new test case. So in the test case name, let's uh, give it a name logout. And click OK. Now logout displayed after valid user login test case. In the documentation, let's add the test case. Click on the edit button. And test case is user should be able to log out so step one click on the logout link after logging in Step 2, verify that login submit button is displayed. The star symbol here represents a bold and if we use dash it will, it will be uh, for an italic format so click ok so now the test case displayed as bold so we don't set up set up teardown timeout template or tags so let's use um, existing variables on the first line so let's uh, put wait until element is visible so for this let's put the valid uh, the logout link and for the timeout let's put 30 seconds the step 2 let's click on so use keyword click element and for the element let's click on the logout link so now let's add 
another wait statement until the submit button is displayed wait until element is visible so for this let's put login button id so we add an assertion page should contain element let's copy this login button id and paste so now let's save this and we click on the run tab and let's execute the test so the robot framework executes well using login case first and then run logout so let's click on start So now both tests are marked with a green circle. It means uh, test passed. So we can look at the report and the log. So let's look at the log. Now the log shows that both login and logout tests passed. So this is login suite and login and the next case is valid user login and valid user logout. So if you look at this line, uh, each keyword is successful and two tests completed within 15, um, within 16 seconds and total past cases are two and there is no failure. We can also look at the report. So all tests passed and start time in the time. So in this video tutorial, you learned how to add test case to existing test case by using robot framework write IDE. And for more information and more examples, uh, please visit seleniummaster.com website. Thanks for watching.